Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman shakes and is out and out in that. Postman Pat is a picture he will be cackled. You, Pat is really sad. It's time to Pat stop! A really it's time to sad. stop! It is knocking time in Greendale. If you knock on Pat's door and go in, you'll be fucked in the ass. <laughs> Julian is getting ready for safety. Bye, Mom. Bye, hi, hi. Jess, have you seen my cock? I put it in my ass. Time with sock. It's our usual sex today, Jess. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat will stop his cat. Major Thorstein has spotted the new note in the post office window. Dash good, dash good, dash good idea. Dash good, dash good, dash good idea. What? Good morning, everybody. Bye, Pat. Bye. No, come here, fucking bitch. She is somewhere around this corner. Ah, uh, there she is. Good morning. <laughs> morning, Mrs. Goggins. We're ready to go to hell. Hope you've got the answer. Oh, yes, I fucking do. And fuck you, Pat. Oh, thanks very much. Go fucking die. Dumb ass fucking bitch. Piece of shit. No, no. What's this? It's a Royal Rail Roast Russ. I go CD. You are a Pat. I know. Oh, that reminds me. You are me. I'll not forget. Cheerio, pitch. Look at look. What? This. The post bus stops outside the post bus. What? The Reverend Tim's seems to be Pat. Pat's all the Reverend. Oh, shit. Hey, I'll have to be going. Goodbye, Reverend. Okay, bye. Crazy bastard. Off he went. Granny Dryden was ready and waiting for Pap. Oh, stop! Pap, stop! Oh, back we go. The door's on the other side. Well, shit. What a lovely way to end my life. Pat was feeling quite gay. Oh, Pat, stop, I've forgotten me act. I knew I'd forget some it. I wonder why God has abandoned us, Jess. Ah, here she comes. Hat. Stop! Look out! We have another asshole, Jess. Miss Hubbard must have a big pussy. Stop, stop! If you could pass me a bag or bag... No fucking way, Miss Fackard. Pat helps with the shopping baskets and carrier baskets. It was a struggle to fit every basket in. Fuck you, Granny Dryden! At last they were able to move. There's Ted Glenn waiting by his workshop. Oh, slow down, Pat! What's he up to? Uh, shit. Fucking hell, mate. He used to be a lot quieter, didn't it, Jess? They went on their way. Oh dear. What now? Stop! 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 Sorry, mate. You can't go this way. The old bridge isn't safe. Boy, shut you all fat ass up. And Alf was waiting to see the new post bus. Oh, what? Granny Dryden was asleep. She was asleep. <laughs> Where are we? Uh, are we there? Look out! Ah, uh, <laughs> What? I think I'll shit in Jess. I'm sure he won't mind. Everybody back here, please, at two o'clock. We'll not be late. But Granny Dryden was asleep. I'll go and look for her. Oh, there you are. Have you seen Miss Hubbard? I'll go and look for Miss Hubbard. 
No sooner had Ted gone than Miss Hubbard came back. Where's Ted gone? Oh, never mind. We'll just have to go without him. Bye, Ted. There's Dorothy waving from her gate. Pa, pa, she said. Mrs Goggins has been on the phone. She's wondering where you've all got to. Why not come in and give her a ring? Some ghost bag once told me the word. Oh. Hello, Mrs Goggins. Yes. No, we haven't been shooting black people. Goodbye. Tight ass. Tea, Granny Dryden. Well, uh, fuck me. Come on, everybody. Time to die. It had been a long day. Here we are, Miss Hubbard. Your stop. Thank you, Pat. Goodbye. Whatever. Then it was Granny Dryden's turn. Here, let me give you a hand down, Granny Dryden. <laughs> me hat. I've lost me hat. Time we go to go. Yes. The old bridge isn't safe. Boy. <laughs>